Okay, it is. E for empathy, L for listen, K for kindness, kindness, L. L. A teacher showed us a video of some kids that raise money to play ball for the blues. Me as well, Emma, thought maybe we should start cheering through. They were like, oh, we should do a charity. And then I heard it. So then she said, could I join? And they said, yes. And then like, uh, here we are. So that's how it came to be technically. <laughs> They came to us a couple of months ago and we ran with it. Nurse Kate and I were available and we kind of helped put their ideas together. It's all of them. We're just here to help support them and make sure their ideas come true. We raised snow gear for people that are in need and there was even some sweatshirts and sweatpants. So if kids like wanted to play outside but they didn't have any snow pants or gloves or jackets and, have to, and they were all too small for them, they could have got to keep them so they could next year maybe they could still fit. We were able to do over 200 winter clothing items. We had different jobs like some of us did the mittens. Some of us did the scarves, some of us did the snow pants. We helped organize it and put it in every box. It's just a kind thing to do. You are awesome. You are amazing. Let's go, Nolton. <laughs> we are creating posters for our classmates who are going to the Special Olympics. So if you don't see what you need, we need the like a flower. We are doing posters for Special Olympics. While they eat lunch, we're going to share news that they'll probably be able to go to the Special Olympics to help support and possibly volunteer. Wash your hands. Special Olympics here in our district is May 10th. There's Kate and I are really trying to work with the other adults to figure out if there's something that we can do to volunteer and watch and cheer on your classmates. So it would be like a little mini field trip. And we could also get them water. Yeah. It would be like during school or like after school. It'll most likely be in the morning. So it would be like the first half of your day. We've emailed parents to give them a heads up that we're in the planning process. Mm -hmm. But when we let parents know when we have a definite thing, we'll definitely let you parents know as well. Are you excited? Yeah. 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 for Special Olympics. And we're going to hand out waters. Yeah. It's a special day for them because they compete through like challenges and it gives them a chance to win. Alright, so listen, we are all there. Yeah, you should bring sunscreen. My dad definitely came prepared. All they brought is this, but I mean, there's a thousand other things to eat, so we'll be good. We can survive. Please rise. Today, your national anthem is being presented by Noble Highs only, Treble Choir.
the opening remarks. Special Olympics. And we're supporting others. I love supporting people. I'm very proud of them. It takes a lot of work to run the Olympic as You've been seeing. I made a chant on it. That didn't really, I know that says chant, but it means but it's supposed to be chaos. special because people get to see that other oh, people can be different. Hey, would you like some water? Yep. Thank you. You're welcome. Look in. And even though people are different, you should still support them like you would for somebody like you. Well, yeah. Would you like some water? Perfect. Thank you. You're welcome. It's really important to support other people so that they feel good about themselves. You got this, guys! Makes people happy when you cheer for them. Their teachers have been really supportive as well as their parents. I think that they're really proud that these 10 young girls have these great big ideas.